Hey everybody, Corey here, and uh, I just completed a final walkthrough with some of my clients who are set to close on their property tomorrow. If it's not kind of self-explanatory, a final walkthrough is a walkthrough that you do on a property uh, that you're purchasing. Typically, it's the day before you're set to close, and closing is the time where the funds exchange hands and legally the property moves from the seller to the buyers, and it becomes the buyer's property. So the importance of doing a final walkthrough is to basically go through the property and make sure that the property is being delivered to you as you bought it, meaning everything that's supposed to be there is still there, everything that's supposed to be gone is gone, and that the property wasn't damaged in the course of them moving out. Doing the final walkthrough, 99% of the time, uh, everything is good. The property's been cleaned up, uh, there's provisions in an offer to make sure that that is legally supposed to happen. We'll go through and uh, test appliances, we will run taps and flush toilets, and to basically make sure that the property is as as it should be but in the event that for some reason uh, something is damaged or broken or let's say garbage has been left behind at the property then we still have time to actually go and speak with the buyer's lawyer and say hey listen there's garbage that's been left at the property we think it will cost us a couple hundred dollars to have somebody come and clear it up so let's hold back five hundred dollars at the time of closing and once we get that cleaned up if there's any money left over uh, it didn't cost us five hundred dollars we can send the remaining amount back on to the sellers but let's just get the property closed but if let's say you don't do a final walkthrough and you show up and there's garbage left at the property there's essentially no recourse over a couple hundred dollars you're not going to go and pursue legal action because it's cost prohibitive so that's the importance of doing a final walkthrough is to not only catch small things like that but in the event if there's something large then you would want to be able to go to your lawyer and in worst case scenario it would potentially delay closing or cancel closing altogether I've never had that happen but it does happen from time to time so so that's the importance of doing a final walkthrough i hope that you found that helpful and insightful uh thanks for tuning into this video other than that i hope you're having a fantastic day and who knows maybe we'll chat soon